Hi guys, it's Kay. Welcome if you're new, and if you're already a part of my crew, welcome back. Today we are making something for the fur babies. One of the most common dog allergies are eggs. So this recipe is going to be egg free. And only three ingredients. All right, let's jot down these ingredients. Let's get started. First ingredient, one half cup of a hundred percent pumpkin. Second ingredient, one fourth cup of peanut butter. And last ingredient, one third cup of self rising flour. We are going to stir in the sweet potato. Next, peanut butter. And stir the ingredients together. Next, let's add in the flour. And now stir. It's time to get a flat surface and sprinkle it with some flour. Let's just add the dough. Grab a rolling pin, also coat the rolling pin in the flour. And begin. And roll it out. After you've rolled it out to about a half inch thick, about half inch thickness. Then grab your favorite cookie cutter. I'm going to use this dog shaped cookie cutter. I think it's fitting <laughs> for what we're doing today. And just press. Grab a s I'm gonna just Loosen it up a little bit there. Grab a spatula. Pull away the excess. And there you have one biscuit. Okay, I'm gonna move this over a little bit. Let's get that pan. You can either cover your pan in parchment paper or I am using foil. After you coat it in either parchment paper or foil, then you lightly oil your paper or foil with either a olive oil or avocado oil. Or, and then now, place your biscuit. And 
and then just continue doing that till you get all of them done. Now we are going to bake in the oven 15 to 20 minutes or till or until golden brown. Okay, time's up. And they're done. Okay, once your biscuits have fully cooled down, just Place them in a nice container with a lid. Oh, I almost forgot. I have a guest waiting at the table. I don't want to be rude, so uh, let's join them. Today's guest is my two-year-old Shih Tzu Princess. <laughs> okay. See how excited she is? She already knows what these are. <laughs> okay, here we go. Well, there you have it. <laughs> uh, as you can see, she really likes the recipe, so I think you should try it as well. If you have any fur babies in your home, Leave a comment down below. Let me know what kind of fur babies and what are their names. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe. And we will see you guys next time. All right. Cooking and kisses. Bye. <laughs>